Hello and welcome to this tutorial for Blackboard Learn. In our previous tutorial, we learned how to create a digital assignment within a Blackboard content area. So here we go, in the instructor viewpoint, we have an assignment that's been added into Blackboard. I've put it into the assignments content area. So this one's ready to go, available for students to see. So I'm going to log out and we're going to jump in as a student and see how we can go ahead and take a look at this assignment and turn it back in. So I will log out. Alright, so let's get into our course. So here we are in Blackboard in the student view. We know our assignment is in the assignments category. And so here's assignment one. So the student just needs to click assignment one. And they'll be able to start reviewing information for the assignment. So we know certain instructions, when it's going to be due, the total points possible. And then there are instructor files that have been attached to this assignment. So they can be downloaded or looked at right by clicking on the link there. Okay, so once you figure out what you need to do for the assignment, you gotta go and do the assignment. Once you get everything complete, you have the ability to submit it right here through the text box. Now typically that's not the way that you're going to be sending in your assignments as a student. Uh, you'll create something in a Word document or some other kind of format and then attach it to this assignment. So that's where the attach button is. It's browse my computer. So you're able to go in there, attach your assignment, and you'll be able to view your assignment as well. Now if you have multiple files you need to attach, you'll just click on that Browse Computer button again and you can attach another file. If you need to leave any comments, you can do that there. And finally, lower on the page, you'll have the ability to save this as a draft or submit the assignment. So if you're still working on it and you're not quite ready to submit, then go ahead and hit Save Draft. Right now I'm ready to go, so I'm going to submit my assignment. And now my assignment has been turned in through Blackboard. You'll notice now that you'll have a review submission history to give you an idea as to what you actually turned in and its current grading status. So if I hit OK right now, I'll get right back into my assignments content area. Now if you remember in my prior tutorial I had set it up so there are two attempts at submitting this assignment. So I can go back to assignment one and there is a start new submission. So I'll go ahead and just do it one more time to where I can Let's just attach a document this this round here. Alright, and I'm going to submit this assignment. So there we have it. Two assignment attempts that I was able to submit, and I'll hit OK. Now, as a student, anytime I go back to this assignment, I'll have no ability to resubmit. But I can go and review the two submissions that I did put in initially. And I can see what information is attached to those. So the instructor will most likely grade the last submission submitted through Blackboard Assignment Tool. You'll also notice the date and time when you submitted your assignment. So I'll go ahead and click OK there. This completes this tutorial for Blackboard Learn.